Well, hello everyone and welcome to Decorating with Barbara. Today, we are going in the dining room. We're going to see the paint color and then I'm going to need help on some design decisions. We're also going shopping for decor for the dining room. So recently, someone had asked, why haven't you guys seen the dining room? And that's because I have been waiting on a package and it just arrived today. So we're going to see what's inside the box and then I'm gonna need you guys to help with a design decision before we go shopping. Now, I do apologize if it seemed as if I dropped the ball on the dining room, but it's been a little time waiting on the package to arrive. All right, guys, so obviously you can see that it is a chandelier. Now, it's going to take a minute to get it installed because there are over 100 crystals that has to go on this chandelier. So you will have to wait until the reveal of the dining room to actually see the chandelier unless I post a picture over on Instagram or maybe I'll share it in a short video. I'm not sure if you guys are catching the short videos, but sometimes I put a little extra video over there. Okay, so this is the paint color, and I think it turned out beautiful. Um, many people say that it looks black, but it is a very dark brown, which I love. And my oldest son even thought it was charcoal gray. So it's one of those colors that will change depending on the lighting. So the question that I have for you guys is, should I put the mirror over the buffet or the picture? Should I use one lamp or two? Or should I use lamps at all i think the chandelier once it's up may be very busy and so i may not need any lamps in here at all oh and then the last decision that i may make is whether or not to paint the mirror gold tell me your thoughts and then we'll visit this room a little later if you are familiar with restoration hardware, they always have beautiful lighting, but their furniture is understated. And so that's the look that I'm going for. Simple elegance. So if you want to chime in on some of the ideas, leave your comment down in the comment section below. Okay, so let's go shopping, guys. Okay, so we're here at a local store called Seville Home, and I just wanted to come in and take a look at some pretty bowls. They have beautiful home decor, and I thought I would stop by and take a look and see if there was anything here that I could find for my home. Now, they are a little pricey, so if I don't find anything, then the trip is just for beautiful inspiration. Okay, this bowl is beautiful and I have expensive taste. 
This is over a thousand dollars. Okay, so we're back at Home Goods. I was here earlier in the week and I saw a bowl, so I stopped back by to see if maybe that $79 bowl looked a little better today. Definitely, it would look better than $1,028. 